Hello everybody, it's the 22nd of November, beautiful afternoon to go fly. Uh, calm winds, reasonably warm temps in the upper 50s here in the Richmond, Virginia area. Today's flight I'm focusing on the AOA calibration in the G3X. I'm not confident my AOA is calibrated correctly uh, based on when I'm hearing tones, the uh, chop tone, steady tone, etc. So the first part of this flight, I go up and do some stall series, slow flight, and just try to get a, an idea of what numbers they're correlating to, uh, do a stall config, uh, recalibration rather. So I'm not going to bore you with that video. I'm not sure that I did it correctly, and I'm going to go out and do it again another day. I did notice during some of my stall work, uh, it still had high RPM, around 1700 RPM. It should be power off landing configuration for the calibration. So I'm going to go uh, past that, and um, let's just go look at some landings over at Dinwiddie on the grass, just practicing some landings and getting my speeds even slower. But also you'll see some attention to the AOA uh, in the G3X, which is on the left side of the uh, vertical tape. One other takeaway on this flight is notice on the G3X bottom right, what I've had in the past was the ADSB traffic, but I typically use my GNC 355 for that display, so no need to duplicate it. I tried something new today, and that's the nearest airports option for the bottom right um, inlay. I found it to be extremely useful information. I did have to change from external navigator to internal navigator so that I can use the Direct 2 with a G3X uh, based on interaction with that inlay, but that inlay offers all kinds of great information. Um, uh, radio comm information, weather information, uh, try changing to the nearest airports on an inlay, uh, tap on it, um, and uh, look at the information you can navigate to with the outer wheel on the bottom right of the G3X, and uh, really some great information. I really like that widget and uh, the ease of navigation and uh, viewing waypoint information, etc. So I'll show this uh, in the beginning as well as the end of the video, I'll go into more detail of what it provides towards the end as I head back to the home base. But uh, give this a try. You might be amazed. Sun is going to be a problem. Hanover, traffic banana 7018 November is part in the area to the west. Hanover. Traffic control light paraglider, one mile to, I'm sorry, one and a half miles to the south at 1400 on approach to the lane in the field just south of the tie down. Then ready. All right, I got the grass in sight now. Three. 53, we're good. AOA still in the green, should be yellow here. Watch your speeds and see how the airway correlates. Dinwiddie, traffic ultralight paraglider is clear of the active. Thank you, Dinwiddie. Dinwiddie, yeah. traffic light cub, 8 November Charlie, turn in final for the grass, 2 3, Dinwiddie. Yeah, No tones, 48. And Hoover at Ashland, uh, Citation 24, go. Yeah, uh, Citation 24, go. We're going to be on the ground with you in about uh, 10 minutes. Uh, we're just picking up one passenger. You're going to be a quick turn. Dinwiddie traffic, Agent Member Charlie, turn to final 2 3 for the grass. Dinwiddie. Barely in the 
yellow on AOA. Hanover traffic 256, we're turning to the left base, 16. 46. Okay, here we go. A little bit closer to the power curve. That's better. That actually felt much better. Denwardy traffic, White Cup 8, November Charlie, turn to final, 2-3 for the grass, Denwardy. T-squared approach. Only T-squared knows what that means. Time likely for that. Mm -hmm. uh, roger that. Tinway traffic, Oscar Fox Drop Pop. I'm sorry, Tinway traffic, uh, number 869, Julia Romeo is texting runway 23. And everybody traffic, I remember Charlie, turn to final 2 3 for the grass, Dinwiddie, and caution for birds in the grass. Lots of bird activity. And Hannibal traffic, set cases down midfield, left downwind, not 1 6, Hannibal. 50. Alright, she wants to sink right there. Bounce from that, uh, not too bad actually. A little burst on the power. Three miles north of the field. So, uh, ramp. earlier I mentioned about the nearest airports. Keep my eyes out. Another airplane uh, out this way. Um, interesting how this widget works. At airport selection, wind data, um, weather info, and AWOS, QRs, NDBs, intersections, user waypoints, I guess, air traffic control, flight service, Airspace. So this is a really formative tool, in my opinion.